Welcome to my greener pasture kitchen. It's our tiny kitchen for now in the RV, but it works. It does all the things that we need it to do. And one of the things that we indulge in, so to speak here, my family and I, are lots of produce, lots of fruits and veggies. And for a very long time, and I blame my mom <laughs> for this. So I grew up just like rinsing whatever produce we got, just like rinsing them under the water, nothing special. And then I started realizing that there are so many like herbicides and pesticides and all the things on your fruits and veggies. And as you can see, we love our fruits and veggies here in this place. So I started researching different things and I've actually seen people post about products that they use. And when I look at the ingredients, I realize that most of the ingredients are filled with toxins and I'm like wait but the whole point was that you wanted to remove the toxins so why are you spraying it with that or why are you using that so I've researched and I've tried a few things I've finally found some something that works so this <laughs> this truly free non-toxic fruit and veggie wash it is the real deal and I'm going to show you how we use it and what we do and when I say it's a real deal it's not like just the product is good and it's removing about 99% of the toxins that it is also green it's green because it's eco-friendly the bottle they use recycled plastic and it's a forever bottle so you get this one bottle and then you purchase refills and you basically mix it together and you make your spray so I'm going to show you how I do that super easy and this company is actually based in the USA. They make these in the USA. That might not matter to you. To me right now, with all the things that are going on in the world, I want to um, kind of like really focus on where I'm getting my products. And that means a lot to me. The ingredients are just a few organic ingredients. And what's not organic are things that can't be organic, so to speak, like some of these like natural minerals and water. Outside of that, we have organic oils like sunflower oil, grapes grapefruit oil and I actually have grapefruit here that's one of the things that I might end up washing so you start off it's like four or five simple steps it tells you use a scissor well actually you first you start with the bottle you fill it to the fill line so they make it really easy and um, I'll go ahead and attach a link where you can get this at a discounted price but I know that they're they're constantly selling out on the products that they sell so when I say that it is um, this link that I'm going to give you is going to give you the sale price if you don't find it right now and you're watching this video six months from now if you want to shoot me a message maybe I might have an updated link or what have you but this you fill it to the fill line then you open up this packet this is super easy my scissors here and some people use their hand and with some of these things and I'll be doing more let me know what kind of household products you want to see me do more reviews on this particular company I've managed to get a lot of their stuff that I use I usually use their I have their dish soap too as well and I'll probably link that Ooh, oh don't make a mess like I just did but you kind of just top it off here and I'm trying to not make a mess but at least I know it's on the it's on the counters but it's not like a toxic product that I just put on my counters and I have to worry about it so you fill it to the fill line you put the content of the pouch inside of the container and this is recyclable so go ahead and then they say you could top it off so if you want to if you realize sometimes I try not to put too much I go exactly at the fill line and then if I need to top it off I'll go ahead and top it off because I don't want it to be like overflowing so then I put some water in there close it up really close it up shake it up turn it on so I can spray it and then I picked up I'm about to do a very simple no juicer video on how to juice so I'm going to add these I'll be washing these as well but um I'll put some water in here just so I can be able to show you what it looks like so I'll put some water in here open up my bag so I'm going to be juicing all of these and like I said it's going to be a no 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 juicer juicing and I'll wash a few other things just so you can see the steps that I go through to wash them so I put that in that large mason jar so then I take my fruits and veggies and I just kind of spray them and rub them a little bit tell them how much I love them <laughs> I'm thankful for the nutrients that they're about to put in my body 
and just rub it a little bit. But I'll do this for a lot of the fruits and veggies. Not a lot of them, all of them. Every fruit and veggie in this place gets this done. Strawberries, grapes, and I actually have some strawberries that I might dump in here as well. So I kind of rub it on it and then I just submerge it into the water. So I'll do a few. I'll fast forward through this part so I can um, go ahead and do a few. And let me know what you've been using, what you've tried so far on your fruits and veggies. Let me know that in the comment section. But this is what I've found to work the best. The ingredients are the cleanest. And I put too much water in there, especially since I have a lot more stuff. Let me grab some strawberries. Hold on one second. Any berries, actually. I'll wash some strawberries. And usually, I just purchased these, so they haven't been washed. Usually what I like to do is like wash everything and then put them back in the containers. Because when you have kids, they're not worried about washing. When they're ready to eat them, they just want to eat them. They don't care about anything else. So they'll just be ready to eat everything. So I just kind of like dump everything and clean everything together. And I'll show you what the water looks like once I'm done. And I'm going to have to use another. I really need to get better at planning what I need before I start the video. The strawberries, especially strawberries, strawberries, you don't know, it's not even just like the, the herbicide. I all Everything that you see here is organic. So like these berries are organic, see, organic. These strawberries here are organic. So you would think like, oh, okay, they're already organic. Why are you so worried about all these things? But outside of <laughs> knowing that, what would you like some of? And some of the things that you made. Would you, some of these, what is this? Some of, some of those things that some, you made. Some of these things that I made? No. Okay, what is the name of this thing here? Real life here happening. What's the name of this? Do you know? Um. You don't know the name of it. Do you know the name of this thing? What, me? Yeah, what is the name of this? If you know the name, I'll give you one once it's clean. Um, um, a ah, you know the name! Okay, I'll give you one more if you could tell me what color it is. Um, what color is it? Tell me. Um, what color is it? That's your favorite. If you, if it's your favorite, potatoes are a really good one to clean too because of all the dirt and stuff that um, remains on it. So you just spray it, like with everything else here though. So you spray it and then you rinse it a little bit in some water. A strawberry? Yeah, you can have a strawberry. I told you. Because you said it was a strawberry. Yes, you can have a strawberry. Let me finish cleaning all the strawberries. But you just spray it and then you kind of rinse it in the water. And you can rinse it underneath the sink. I personally just want it to sit I there know a little that bit. Mommy. You can let this sit on it for a few minutes too and then put it in the water, let it submerge. But I'm going to. I want you to put them in the water. You don't want me to put them in the water? I'm going to go ahead and clean off everything, rinse off everything, and then go from there. But it's super easy. This is by far the best. And I sprayed all those things and I still have basically a full bottle. But, um,. This is pretty much I what I do. Me. Can you come inside? Mm -hmm. Of course you can. Okay. Come on in. So that's basically it. They are clean. So what I'll do is I'm going to put them in something for now. Oh, you know what? Whoop. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. You can leave it. So I'll go ahead and put them in this pot. Everything that's cleaned off, I'll go ahead and put them in the pot just so I can show you what ends up happening to that water. Everything that ends up in it. Yeah, those are blueberries. Blueberries? And strawberries. And strawberries. So I just rinse them off like that. Like and then, I, I, like I said, I want to make a juice with this one. So if you not even stay tuned, it'll be like, I'll link that video. I'll probably post them around the same time. And there, you see the color of that? That was like clear water. I'll show you. Hold on, hold on. Let me go ahead and repackage my lovely blueberries so I can have more room mm -hmm. for my strawberry no no those are not cleaned yet let me, let me yeah I'll show you I'll give it to you in a, in a little bit let me just finish rinsing them off okay I have one of the thing that you a carrot a carrot would you like a carrot uh -huh. here you go pretty lady 
A nice clean carrot for the pretty little girl. How's that? Good, I know it. I love that you love carrots. You know what, what are carrots good for, Safari Rose? For girls. For girls and boys. For boys and girls. Yeah, they're good for both boys and girls, but they're also good for your, for your what? For your eyes. Yes, they're also good for your eyes. Okay, so let me show you. This is the water. It was a clean water. I should have brought it closer, but you saw me feel it was like clean water, but now you're seeing all this stuff. And I can imagine the more things I add to it, more, oh my goodness, you could basically see it coming off. And this is the water that I was using where I was spraying it off into. You can see that, you see that? <laughs> this is just where I was spraying, like the original spray and touch station. Look at that. This here, this veggie rinse, all your fruits and veggies, like I can't even get over it. Do you see that? Okay, so if you're just rinsing on, under the sink, trust me, you are not, you are not getting it as clean as I'm getting it right now. So I rinse everything like this, to be honest with you. This water, I should probably rinse it out. Yeah, it's all rinse, baby. I rinse all of it, just for you. Just for, well, not just for you, just for everybody here. Did I spray them? Lord, now I'm losing track. Did I spray these? I can't even remember. Well, at least I know I'm not going to be like, it's not going to be overkill. I'm going to spray them again. Not a big deal. Probably should dump this dirty water out first. Oh, lordy. This is real mom life. Clearly, I am not like... This is a pretty candle. <laughs> this, is, this is like real life. I'm not... This is not an infomercial or anything like this. This is just me sharing something that I absolutely love. Yeah, this is real life. That's my real assistant. She's my been. Real assistant. Who's my real assistant? Me. You, right? Me. Yeah, that pretty little girl. Okay, so I'll, I'll prepackage. I'll repackage everything that I've rinsed already. And, and then, if you want to like give it an extra little rinse with the water, if you. Yeah, I'm going to repackage them because mommy's hands are clean. Actually, Safari Rose, can you help me? Can you get my dish soap from out there, please? So we have a washing station outside as well, as well as having one inside, right on the, right in the outside sink. So I was actually doing some dishes outside earlier, which is beautiful because I can ground while I'm doing those dishes. Just rinse it one more time. And then it's good to go. Like it's perfect for the refrigerator now. So that's ready. This is ready. It's going, oh, I have a few berries in here. I got your thing. You got it for me? Thank you, lovey. I love when you assist me. I like it. You like assisting me? Oh, look at my face. Like you. you love helping me close a little latch. Okay, so um, like I said, we do all the things like this. Apples are great to spray I down and do this with. Me. Thank you. This is what I was telling you. My dish soap. I use the same company for my dish soap. So spray the apples. Me. Did I spray you? Spray Come on me. this side. Come over here so that I don't spray you. So spray down the apples and like especially things like apples they have like this wax that's usually on them and it's oh you don't want that so spray the apples wipe it down a little bit um these things are all th this is also gluten free so if you have a gluten sensitivity it's non-toxic like i said before recycled plastic dye free fragrance free so you don't have to worry yeah don't stand there and that water that color on that water is quickly changing so Whenever you do your grocery run, you can do this or like right before you, right before you serve like a lot of um, things to your, let me take these tables out, they should be done. Right before you serve a lot of things to your family, you can rinse them off. So I'll go ahead and pop those in there and I'll double rinse since um, I'm using the same. So yeah, as you can see, what are these? You know what these are. Don't it's even. Apples. apples. You love apples? Oh, but yeah, that water that I ri I dumped it earlier. And look, it, it's still getting dirty again. Getting pretty dirty. So we'll rinse everything. We'll rinse everything. And um, this is kind of timely too because pear? I just did this grocery run. Yes, you can have a pair. Hold on, let me rinse it. I just did this grocery run. And um, Safari Rose. I'm, I'm actually shooting a video. Did you know that? Can watch that thing on the inside of that Yeah. So once you rinse them and put them um, away for your family, like I was saying, I got
got distracted. Yeah, the wax that was on here, it helps with removing the wax from it. And then you can put them away so that your family, when they grab it, because like the kids, they won't, and I'll put it, as you can see, I put it like in arm's reach. And they go for, there. So they, they could be able to um, grab them. Yeah, and Safari Rose, like, she just loves being on camera. I'm surprised she's over there instead of over here. Do you want to come over here? Mm -hmm. Come on. Come be next to you, Mommy. Yeah, come be next to me. Did I do this? I just, I did. I did. I did because I had everything else. So, yeah, I'm taking all of these out. I like to be next to you, Mommy. Spraying them. Spraying. Let's, the spray. Oh, like this is okay. I want to show you this. This is one that I definitely want to show you because I'm spraying it, and this hair is a little porous. Because it's porous, as I spray it, I just see things dropping. Yeah, I'm going to wash it again. I know I already washed it, but I rinsed it just with water because I needed to do this video. So now I'm rinsing it with this, with this, so that they could be able to see. So let me move these out of the way to right here, so that they can be able to see. So. I'll, I'll do a different one. I already sprayed that one. So this is one that when I spray it. I spray it on you. Am I spraying it on you? I so you see that? It's just, the stuff is just it. dropping into this. I don't know if you can see that. All the dirt, dirty stuff. And like, like Safari Rose said, I, I did already rinse these with just water. But I wanted to do a refill on the bottle and show you how I, I wash my fruits and veggies. Yes, you can have a pear once it's all cleaned off, okay? Is it a pear? It is. It's a type of pear, I believe. Is it a pear? Yeah, I believe they are pears. Safari Rose. And then you just kind of like put them back, put them away. I'm going to put one of those things away. Yeah, put it away. Are you done, Mommy? I'm not, but... Come on in, Safari Rose is already part of the video, so why not have all the kids in the video today? That's great. Can you put the Beyblade stage over there? Okay, so the pears are washed, and this is what the water looks like. No, you, you know what these are, what are these? Potatoes. So put these up. Okay, so this is what the water ended up looking like that was absolutely like clear before. Now, do you see that? It's, it's crazy. It's, going. it's dirty because we sprayed it with a fruit and veggie wash. Can I have a pear? Yes, you may. Enjoy. Can I have a pear? Can you share it or everybody needs their own pear? What would you like? We can clean some oranges the same way. I'm nervous. Y'all making me real nervous right now. Excuse me. I'm sorry I sprayed your face. It's toxin. It's non-toxic. Yeah, good. <laughs> Come here. Let me, let's, let's show them that face. Let's show them that face that said, yeah, good. What's your name, little guy? <laughs> oh, okay. And your name is Safari Rose? Come here. Let me show them that little face. Name is Safari Rose. Let's show them that little face. Yes, you can have a pair of What would you like? step over this way please yeah, so no, this was clear right it was clear from the sink i think they saw me pour it super clear super clear from the sink they saw me pour it okay. See, that's why it's important for us to wash but not just wash with water but wash with something that's going to help strip away all of those herbicides pesticides and all the things that could cause you to get sick mm -hmm. and look at this is this is what that water looks like this is a lot of water so you don't see how dirty it is but do you see that it looks like oil on it. It looks like oil, right? You're right. Because it's not there's parts of it that looks really oily. But you see that dirt as well? You see that dirt settling in there? Yeah. That's why you have to make sure you wash your fruits and veggies before you feed and your, wash your face. family. Yeah, wash your face, of course. And we have toxin free wash. We have the three in one mm -hmm. face bar, mm -hmm. right? That you mm -hmm. wash your face, you can wash your hair, you can wash your body, but that's a video for a different day. And I was not expecting you all to show up and make me really nervous and flustered right now. How long that one got coming? Oh, oh, here's the no, stem. Here's, here's, here's the stem. It's not just a stick. It's a stem, right? Okay, you can put these back. Actually, I'll, I'll take the other blueberries to rinse them. But these are rinsed, so you can go in there, grab a strawberry, and know that you're eating with co You want a strawberry? Yeah, one blueberry. Oh, great. Blueberry. What'd that mean? I want it. You don't want it anymore? Mm -mm. I can't, I, 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 this is the, 
Uh, blueberries? Two, two, and two of both. Blueberries. Two of both. Two of each. And two of each. And one big eat. one, one small one. And one, uh, one big one, one small one. How does want, that taste? I don't want one of them. It tastes big. clean, doesn't it? Let them see your face, boy. Can you go? I don't have that. Mm -hmm. No. You have two blueberries. Well, that means. Oh, sorry, you can come back here, you know, right here. Blueberries? Blueberries. Blueberries. Yeah, so. I didn't get my blueberries. Here you go. Do your kids like fruits and veggies? Mm -hmm. they, just took, they just hijacked the whole video. Anywho, this is it. Talking with my mouth. We'll put these away. Give me the next um, blueberry. I want to show you something. So this is clean. And I'm dumping this water out. You see how that there how dirty that is? Mm -mm -mm. Actually, let's dump it outside. Mm. Let's dump up one more time. Oh, you can see? What's he under it? Mm-hmm. What? Oh my word, you're right. Look at that. This is what he was trying to show. Ew. I don't so like this is that a cool one. thing to do with your kids. Like I was trying to do it with you all, with you. The middle one was the last day. So it wouldn't be a long video. We now have to start a pair back. But it's a good video to do with kids, showing your kids why it's important to clean your veggies. Are you done, Tororo? Mm -hmm. Be careful. Okay, so close the refrigerator. I'm in the pizza. I'm hiding in the pizza. I'm hiding mm. in the pizza. So. Uh, let me see how you wash those. Okay, so let me show you. I just put them in here. Rock the party. Stand right here. Um, can I spray some? Yes, you can. Okay, this is cool. Mm -hmm, it is. Okay, that's enough. Can I do that? Of course. You can't let one child do it without letting the other. Okay. Uh, hi. Spray it right in there. I'm fine. Of course. You can't let two kids do it without letting the third one do it. Come here. I get bored. Or 15. If I had 15 kids, I would not be doing this. I wouldn't have time to be creating content and sharing what I like with people. I would just be over focusing on oh, right there. Okay, that's enough. That's a lot of spraying. We don't need that much, to be honest with you. Okay. Super clean. So now you just do like this, <coughs> right? And this was like rinsed out already. Dumped everything else out that was in it. So then you take a little water to help with the rinsing process. Just kind of squeeze them, not squeeze them because they're berries. You don't want to squeeze them because then that. And then they're gonna be more. In there. And then there's gonna be berry juice. <laughs> okay, so let me show you. Rough part. You keep doing that. Look at right over here. No, no, no. Stand over here because you just keep putting your back of your head in the video, right? I put my head in the video. Okay. So here, look at. You see what, what happened? You see that water? It's not clear anymore. See that? Where's the under it? Oh my word! And that was clean water. So what I do is once I'm done with that. Yeah. Package it. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, they, should, they, should, they should do this. They should, but they're not going to waste their time. Hold on, hold on. They're not going to waste their time to make sure each one. They pack them in. That's good to go for them. That's enough. They expect you to do it. And then people are touching it and stuff. So it's really up to you. And then I'll rinse it one more time just under the water. Like that. I'm taking And then. I'm taking it. You can refrigerate that kind, sir. And you, are you going to need to wash it? Again? No. Before you eat it, it's good to go. What so look at it. You see that? I'll show you. This is just the berries. Gross. <laughs> Gross? Gross. That's just the berries that, that happened. So this is all our dirty water. I just dropped my squash. Jabari, put, this, put that underneath. Squash, mm -hmm. mommy, it's a gourd. It's a gourd. Yeah, it's a gourd. Let me see the thing. You mean it's a gourd? It's a squash. Give it to me. It's a gourd. Animals, dinosaurs, bump heads. Dinosaurs. Can, You've been watching this, Dinosaur Train again, huh? This, oh, Lord. Yes, you can have some. Okay. Well, that's that. I'll have the link in the comment section of this video where you can purchase yours. If you want to see what we do daily, be sure to check out. Be sure to check out our group on Facebook, My Greener Pasture Utopia. Your hands were dirty. Ooh. My greener here playing in the dirt outside again. I see. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay, turn around. Okay, go ahead. All right, My.
I Grant Process Utopia. And um, let us know in the comment section if you like this, found it of value. Be sure to let us know. And that's really it, right, gang? Yeah. All right. Bye. <laughs> you want to come and say bye with those berries no. in your hands? No.